<laughs> it's a privilege. Not a right. <laughs> hey, a right. I, I love Jake Ferguson, man. I love the dude, bro. I, yeah. I like his mentality. I yeah. think that I think if we can get ten more dudes that think like him, oh, yeah. on offense, we'd be in good shape. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it's that there's that desire, the determination. Because like I think we've had this conversation. At one point, I thought Pendershot was gonna leap Jake Ferguson at one point, but then Ferg just like, nah, dog, this it's me. Yeah, 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 yeah. And and, and I'm That's gonna say all this, me. All me for real, John, John Stevens, man. I know he's that's my guy. All, all snapped up, right? Yeah. But don't sleep on him right. if he can come back in any capacity. Right? He will push the schoolmakers and Hendershot as well. So he will push all of those. See, guys. I could mm-hmm. see, I, I could see John Stevens and Ferg having what they thought they were going to get from Martellus Bennett and Jason Witten. Okay. They didn't quite work mm-hmm. out. That yeah. two tight ends. I could one hundred percent see something like that. I can see something like that. You know where you can see that from? Because Mike McCarthy, everywhere he's been, he had that dynamic tight end. Mm -hmm. Mike McCarthy, believe it or not, played tight end way back in the day. (laughs) He knows that spot. He knows that role. He knows Mm -hmm. what to get the most out of it is what I'm saying. Not saying that Mike McCarthy is running any Y option routes as a tight end now. (laughs) All right, so let's talk about some of these available free agents. Okay. That are, that are still, what, what, we got something for me? I like the position. He just brought up running back. Okay. And it's, been re- it's getting reported. And I know a lot of people are going to be like, oh, man. But A.J. Dillon. A.J. Dillon is very, very interesting to mm. me. And I know people are looking Three point at the four box yards. scores. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Per, I know I, 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 he's not going to be here to put up stats. Right. right. He's going to be here to bruise up the opposing defense. That's why he's going to be here. The most frustrating thing to watch last year, watching that running back room of Tony Pollard, Rico Dowdle, nothing against mm-hmm. you, Rico. I know you was on Twitter like, hey, what'd I do? <laughs> <laughs> and, and Deuce Vaughn was them falling backwards every time someone breathed on them. Okay. So let's but talk. Like oh. paperweights. A.J. Dillon, he's, he's a sledgehammer. You need a sledgehammer back. Yeah. No matter who you yeah. bring in, it got to be a mm-hmm. sledgehammer, bro. So yeah, let's let's yeah. talk about some of the, these uh, couple of names that are on the free agent market as far as running backs. Okay. We have A.J. Dillon that you just mentioned. What about this name? Clyde Edwards Hilaire. Don't he have an injury history? Um and I don't know about him. Yeah, I, probably, I don't know about I don't know about Clyde. I, I, who who's the next available option? Uh J.K. Dobbins. Okay. All right. Those yeah. are the they have right now the top three that the Cowboys probably I like J.K. That's a work I ethic like guy, yeah. man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gritty work ethic guy. I like Gritty. that. Okay. So let's talk about uh, some of these tackles because we know we have a whole of tackle potentially, okay? Mm-hmm. Coming back to Tyron Smith, is that an option? I think that if you're going to try to sign a left tackle in free agency, mm-hmm. what sense does it make to go outside the building? Exactly. Thank you, my brother. Mm-hmm. That, that's, you, my that's, brother. that's all mm-hmm. I'm saying. Because he, he was an all-pro last year, wasn't he? Wasn't, all, wasn't Tyron Smith all pro last year? I think, I think he, he did. Was a, yeah, oh, it was, yeah. Yeah, he, he made did. second team all he pro. Did. He or made like some, that, some one of those things. Yeah. yeah. Tyron he, Smith had an him, amazing year last he, year. He had an amazing year. It was one of his better years. And, the, you know, the war of attrition with him, I get it. But, man, we figure out the code, and now we want to get rid of him. <laughs> like, yeah. We cracked the code. All right, now you just ship them all. Hey, that's yeah. getting all the cheat codes I on wonder, GTA and trading the game in the I next day. I wonder if that would have worked for Sean Lee back in the day. He's mm. like, look, I, seriously. Lee, Lee, you just don't, don't practice, practice bro. Man. Just play. Yeah, just play. Just play. Just play the game, Go out there man. and hit people on Sunday. All right, here's another tackle name that has a tie to Mike McCarthy. David Bakhtiari. Mm. Yep, that's exactly where I was going. Yeah. If you look up his stats, man, he's been hurt more than Tyron. Yeah. Now, maybe they bring in the Tyron program to him, and yeah. maybe that can work. But his last good year was 2018 or 19, if, I have, if, if I'm not. I see him going to the Jets to go be with his boy. That, that's what I personally see. Hey, that hurt. He considered retiring, too. 